Hi everyone, just a quick reminder that my 300 subs giveaway is still going on for another 24 hours or so. If you haven't seen the announcement video, then basically I'm going to be giving away every single Sanrio item in 50 Nook Mile tickets as a celebration of 300 subscribers. And all you have to do is fill out the Woo Rise form in the description before tomorrow at 12 p.m. Pacific time zone, and just like that, you're entered. There are still like 180 slots remaining, so don't feel bad about taking anyone's spot. It is free to enter, and yeah, enter the giveaway if you want. You don't have anything to lose. Alright, on, on with the video. Hello my beautiful Sunshine Crossing viewers and welcome back to another episode of my Stardew Valley themed island star drop. Basically, if you guys missed it in last week's episode, I restarted my old island Blossom and made a new one called Star Drop, which is based off of the farming simulator Stardew Valley. you haven't seen that video i highly recommend you go watch it um so we are still in the early stages of the game so we are just going to be progressing further might get some more villagers i don't know so um make sure you go ahead and leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy this type of content and without further ado let's get into it so we're starting our day off with a letter from daisy may uh i never do the stock market because i always end up messing it up somehow but i like daisy may she's pretty cute and in the last episode we also unlocked nook's cranny so yeah um we're checking that out <laughs> and it seems like timmy and tommy are having a very ominous conversation with mabel i think they both like her um that that should be trouble and then she just goes and waves at me like nothing happened so are you guys gonna tell me like what that conversation was what, what kind of love triangle is this okay there's nothing too exciting in here today um i could use this homework set um for a build i've got planned and i guess i'll also take this drying rack because why not and we've also got leaf here today that should be helpful considering that it's a stardew valley island and we'll need crops and stuff we could say that our name's lauren or lauren that's a tough decision i'm pretty sure that the person that made leaf was a pretty big fan of bob ross let's decide maybe there's a happy tree am i right or am i right Okay, let's go ahead and buy the sugar cane. If possible, even. This build is even getting better with nature. Like, if it can get better. I mean, it's already, like, really, really good. First to me and Tommy and now you. Why is everyone having such ominous conversations, like, right when I walk in? It's just too much for one raccoon. Well, that sounds like a you problem because you you're gonna get yourself out of the mess you created. And don't give me that look. I mean, I mean if you like Tom Nook, I'm sorry, but... I really don't have a choice. I never signed up for this. All I wanted was to have a little bit of a thrill and fun and adventure and go to a deserted island. I, I never asked to be in charge. And so now I guess we're just gonna go ahead and build a bridge. Um, I wish you could build the bridges every time instead of having to like go pay for them. All right, we made our bridge. Um, that was actually like super easy. Um, I had most of the materials already that I needed, but now I'm relatively low on materials for the rest of this uh big project that tom forced us to do this place looks fine for the bridge i'm just i'm just gonna put it somewhere random like you know what all, all the rivers are gonna be gone once i get terraforming there there you go i let you in on my devious plans don't tell anyone <laughs> really i i don't have a slingshot and there is a bloom just right above my head taunting me okay that, that's it. You are not getting the final word, balloons. We, we're gonna go buy a slingshot right now. And I guess we'll just buy a wetsuit while we're at it because pearls are like a really good way to make money. And the balloon's gone. Wow, just... Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm not salty at all or anything. How come it feels like the whole time I was gone, Tom Nook was just like looking at the door waiting for me to come back? Like, that's creepy. You need to get some hobbies in your life besides waiting for me to come back. Come on. And now we're just gonna go ahead and set up those housing kits. I admittedly do not remember how this works. Like, whether I'm supposed to like go villager hunting or whatever. Um, I already got Gale at one random island, so... um. I don't know if she's gonna move in with these or if I have to wait for the other one. I feel like the first three just autofill, but I don't remember, so I, I don't know. I'm, I'm not gonna, I don't think I'm necessarily gonna risk it, so I guess I just won't go villager hunting. Beep, 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 beep,
and um, I really probably should be doing my money trees, but um, I haven't been. Like, I haven't done one money tree on this island, so um, yeah, we're just we're just not gonna talk about that. Oh my goodness, guys! You know what this means? We're getting our revenge on the blue balloon, Tropical Vista. That sounds like a pretty cool DIY. Let's see what that is. Oh, it's it's a wallpaper. Mm. Okay, well, all right, we've got one classic picture. We're making progress, slowly but surely, I guess. I don't think we can get to this one. It's like over the river. I don't think I've ever gone through so many axes in my entire life. All right, what do we need again? We need, um, log stuff and a water pump. Okay. Ah, this is costing all of my hardwood. All right, we've got, we've got our log things painfully. No, why are you sitting down? And since I have no clay for the water pump, uh, let's just work on the inside of that house. I I know this video is very unstructured and I'm just going all over the place and I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, we're just going from house to house and there's it's it's in the off and it's in the opposite chronological order, plot 3, plot 2, then plot 1. I don't I don't know. I don't know what this video is. And the peach stuff should be pretty easy. Um so now we're working on house 1 and um I honestly really don't know what the peach surprise box is. It's like it's like a little shirtless baby popping out of like a peach that splits in half. I I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you. This this is a very weird item. How did this happen? I'm I'm literally trapped on a piece of land surrounded by water with wasps chasing me and there's and there's no escape because if I get out of my vaulting pool um then then they're going to attack me while while I'm doing that and Wow, I ran into a tree. Yeah, there, there's my untimely death. And that plot plot one was super easy. Um, I have no idea why I didn't do that one first. I don't know. I don't know why I decided to go in reverse chronological order. Just just to like make things harder on myself. I, I don't know. I don't know why I do the things I do. And apparently Tom's telling us to just let the plots autofill. I'm still a little confused on that front, but... Okay, if, if we could have villager hunted, then I'll just kick myself in. Yeah. Oh my goodness, it got sold just like that. Who is here? Oh, it's Eric. Oh, I actually had him on my old island. Um, I kind of wish I got a new villager, so it's like a fresh start uh, from my old island. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, don't read too much into it. Eric's, Eric's a fine villager, so if you like him, then I'm not saying he's bad. No, stop sitting! All right, so we time hopped and the news for today is that we got eric and yeah that's about it i will say that his house goes pretty good with the decorations we set up for him oh he's actually pretty cute like cuter than i remember Ooh, we got another balloon Ooh, it's a shellfish pochette i do not think i've ever seen that before in my life oh that's actually kind of cute i don't i don't know if i'm gonna make it but Sure. And we've also got red here. Um, I usually don't buy the arts and stuff because um, it's not really something I care about too much. Um, but I guess I'll go visit red's thing in a little bit. But for now, we're just continuing to get supplies. And I'm cutting out a lot of this footage because it's, it's just boring. Oh my goodness, guys. I did it again. I trapped myself. Why, why do I keep doing this? Why? And there is another balloon. I'm making this entire video about balloons. I'm sure it's like 25% of the footage. Oh my goodness. We just learned that, didn't we? What are the odds? Why did this game give us the same DIY twice in a row? I hate this game sometimes. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, that, that is so mean. I, th this means war. All right, we also just finished plot number two, which was also pretty easy. Um, this is the moment of truth. I am scared because we had pretty good luck with Eric and I do not think we're gonna be this lucky again. Um, 
I, I, this is, this is one we need to look up. Um, she's not too bad. I, I don't know. She's, she's actually pretty cute. I think we could have gotten worse. Um, she has kind of weird eyebrows and hair, but yeah, she, she, she's pretty cute. And now all we have left is that stupid water pump. All right. Um, all we need is one iron nugget and three clay. That shouldn't be too bad, but uh, as, as ridiculous as it might seem, clay is very scarce on my island for some reason. All right, we've, we've got the iron taken care of, but the clay, that's, that's gonna be a very fun challenge. Ah, stop giving me money rocks. What, I, I don't even know what Buck is talking about at this point. Okay, we've got a public bench, so. Uh, I guess that's nice. Seems like a pretty random thing to give someone though. Just like randomly. Okay, I did this amount of jumping jacks and then I thought to give you a public bench. Like, okay. I, I'm not gonna question it. I mean, it is Animal Crossing logic. All right, we needed more clay. So I just went ahead and time hopped some more. And there she is. I have absolutely no idea how popular she is. Um, but basically I, I stand by what I said earlier. She's pretty cute. She's just those eyebrows, I just, I can't, I can't not look at them. And finally, 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 we've got our water pump. And it works and everything, somehow. Um, and to reward us for completing all the homes, Tom Nook gave us some fencing, so that's nice, I guess. You guys don't care if we, like, go check out who the villager is at that plot right away, do you? I mean... You, you don't really care if we do some fencing first. I mean, you like you like being in suspense. I mean, I know you do. Who who doesn't, right? I'm, I'm doing you guys a favor. And it is Gail. Oh, yeah. Oh, so that's where she comes in. Okay. So does that mean we could have villager hunted this whole time and we didn't have to let the plots autofill? Should I even go for it? I don't trust balloons anymore. I'm scared. Oh, it's a rocket lamp. Okay, that's not bad, but I'm, I'm still not forgiving the balloons. No, never. All right, Um, I, I just realized that I've never been in my house while it's been in house form before, so we should probably go check that out. Make sure that nothing's burned down in there and also put the lamp in so we can get it out of my pockets. Kill two birds with one stone. No, God, please, no, no. And let's, uh, Let's just take a look at some things in nooks as well. Um, I guess I'll get this flamingo because, um, why, why not? And, um, resident services the next day is upgrading itself. So, um, wow, we, we made it. This is really where things start to change. And I'm very, very proud of our progress in just two days. And here is Gail, our precious baby. Love her so much. Love that little heart on her face. And um, we've also got Mabel here today. Um, I, I guess we should try to get Abel sisters. I honestly have no idea where the shops are gonna fit in um, in my Stardew Valley themed island, uh, but we'll try to make it work. Wow, Tom is just completely fanboying over KK. Wow, calm down. Oh, this is about Happy Home Paradise, isn't it? I don't want to do this right now. Why am I always getting forced to work in these games? Do I look that old to you? I'm pretty sure this is child labor. And we finally, finally, finally finished our campsite. This is very exciting. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited to see who we get as our first campsite villager in the next one of course um you guys you guys don't mind waiting do you all right so that is gonna be it for this week's video make sure you leave a like and subscribe with post notifications turned on so you will never miss out on a star drop episode and also maybe even comment i don't know i always like reading what you guys have to say and yeah thanks again and with that i will see you all later <laughs>